Hey everybody, welcome back once again to another episode of Jurassic Park Builder, where today we are greeted by Kelly, who wants us to put down some new decorations and sell off two decorations. How, how incoherent. I mean, she doesn't even, like, give us any specifics. She's just like, ah, oh, put down any two decorations and, and then sell two decorations. So honestly, honestly, if she wasn't watching my every move, I could just put down two decorations. And then that would be the mission, right? But, but no, no, that is, uh, not the case. So, we just gotta do what we have to do as we collect our dinosaur coins. And speaking of which, um, I've been meaning to bring this up for a while, but I'm thinking about starting a new, uh, Jurassic Park series, um, soon. I'm, I'm not sure if, if I'm going to yet or not, but... Um, if that's something that you guys would be interested in, I'm, I don't really want to share all the details yet, but it's it's another it's another um, park uh, builder, basically, and um, there there are a limited amount of them out there, but uh, I think you guys will enjoy it. I, I really think you will. So um, leave a comment and, and tell me if you guys would be interested in that or not. And, um, if you are, we'll, we'll go ahead and, and get into it, um, relatively soon. Um, cause, let's be honest, I mean, Jurassic Park Builder, it's, all, it's only going to, um, go downhill. <laughs> cause, it, it seems, it honestly, legitimately seems that all we're doing anymore now is we're just collecting coins. And, um, it's gotta be said, it, it's not, it's not that entertaining. I mean, sometimes it is. Sometimes just, like, the scenarios and, like, the storyline is a little crazy. But, uh, otherwise, otherwise it is a little boring. So, um, yeah. Anyway, um, let's go ahead and move these things around just because they're kind of getting in our way. I think that was a mission that we just completed for Kelly. Is that right? I think so. As we watch our Inclosaurus. We need to do another tour, like, or another. Have we done one? Uh, just, like, going through the park and, you know, actually enjoying our animals like this? I think we should. We should do a video just like that. And just, like, kind of scroll around and really enjoy the animals that we have here in the park. What you say? I think so. Ferris wheel still has 52 hours left on it, so we're not going to finish, um, that anytime soon unfortunately so what are you gonna do you know what are you going to do all right well code red comes along we gotta complete that I mean we don't really have anything else we can do um, at this point so here we are And I really have a feeling that, that we can get a high score this time if we try hard enough, you know? We just need to let our dinos get up there. And... Let's see here. I don't think we've ever looked at our raptors up close like that before. That That's kind of cool. I mean, they're red, but still, you know? It's kind of cool. How would you like to be the car right there, stopped outside all the carnivore tracks? It's awesome. I would hate to be that guy. Have a dino just like storm out of his cage. You know, one of these days, John Hammond needs to be in that situation. And then maybe he'll stop freaking recreating Jurassic Park. <laughs> or maybe not. Maybe he will, um get sliced and diced by a T-Rex and and then that'll be it and we won't have to um, worry about dinosaurs taking over the world anymore you know or getting off the island or etc etc three two can we get both of these um, yeah we did okay 44 great Absolutely wonderful. So we were a thousand less than we were last time. That's 
That's just weak, you know? I thought we could have done better. I really did. I was trying, but... Like I said before, we, we really do need to rearrange, um... Rearrange our... Our, um... Dinosaurs so we can do, like, a little cheat, you know? That would be cool. Have you seen my official documentaries? They're terrible. Um... Okay, so, so she's saying that the ones that she's done for Hammond, I guess, are terrible, and now she wants to make her own movies, which, honestly, I don't have a lot of faith in her. I think that they're probably going to be, like, in the category of Transformer movies, and, like, the respect that she's probably going to rely on special effects, like the dinosaurs, to, um, tell her story. Like, I haven't ever heard a T-Rex, um, narrate, and it probably won't be that good, you know, so, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. But you never know. You never know. That'd be actually cool if um they released like an update to Jurassic Park Builder at um you know when, or if they released a Jurassic Park Builder 2 and like there was an animation in the beginning where Kelly's film was going, you know, and we could actually see um what she's been talking about this entire time. Wouldn't that be awesome? I just don't know exactly what Jurassic Park Builder 2 would be about. Maybe, perhaps, uh, a, a, a Site B, maybe? I, I don't know. I'm, j I'm, I'm, just, I'm just tossing out all these original ideas. Um, maybe, maybe that will work. I never know. So, we are researching some new DNA that we found, and holy crap! You know, I, I just realized... It's been forever since we found some DNA, hasn't it? It really has. It. It's been like an eternity, and um, I, I really should have made um, <laughs> maybe more of a fuss about it uh, before now. But um, here we are. We're three clicks away from finding out what kind of new dinosaur we have. Oh my God! The tension, the tension, you guys. Come on. What do we got? What do we got? I hope it's like another turtle or something. That'd be kind of cool. Hanosaurus. A uh, Hanio? Hano? Well. Just another fish to add to our fishbowl, I guess. You know, I'm beginning to think that Malcolm is a little sadistic um somehow we just completed a mission of his and now he's saying that you know um oh oh right uh <laughs> so he wants us to do a code red so let's go ahead and do another code red what the heck you know and um i tell you what i i i i'm going to rearrange these dinosaurs i just have not done it yet um i promise i will do it uh relatively soon because probably before our next code red, I'm sure. Cause like you know, it's it's been long enough this setup we've had it, and I really think that moving the dinos uh, soon could give us a strategic advantage <laughs> when it comes to gathering some coins. And I said it before, I'll say it again. I'm an idiot for even uh, moving them out of that prior setup that we had so you know but one of the advantages to this setup is that we do have decorations around all the dinos so they're generating more coins um, per punch basically than they would if they were just all grouped together back to back so it has its advantages it has its disadvantages you just gotta uh, weigh them both equally and and decide what works best for you really because it is your park after all so, we're really letting some of these get close. Oh, <laughs> okay, good. We we got that. Oh man, if we had a dino escape now, after all this time, I I would just well, I wouldn't lose it, but I, I'd be disappointed. I would be very disappointed in myself, really. Oh, <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me, really. <laughs> Ah. <sighs>
well, there you have it. You know, I mean, we we had a good run, but um, eventually this was inevitable. You know, I mean, especially with uh, chaos theory and everything. Freaking shut up, Malcolm! You jackass! You're just rubbing it in. You know, uh, thirty-five levels, millions of coins, millions of hours, and we let a dino escape. That is just a travesty, unlike any other. Does he come back? Some of you have been saying that they do come back. Oh yeah, he does. He's he's only on a 15 minute break. That's <laughs> that's not bad. It's it's Al's 15 minute break. Oh jeez, that um that's quite refreshing for him, I'm sure. I'll go get a snack of some human uh, sitting somewhere. So. Let's go ahead and try to calm our nerves after that um, life-shattering incident occurred <laughs> and, and try to level up our Pachyrhinosaurus. He only has one more to go, so I think we can do it. Oh yeah, we're good. He had a facial pad on his face that was a scar and not a normal feature. Paleontologists really originally thought that... Um, yeah. Well, it really balls that up, didn't I? <laughs> oh well. You can go back and read it later. Jeez. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and collect some of these coins and just, you know. I'm I'm so just beside myself really that we let that dino escape. Allosaurus. Out of all the dinos, why did it have to be Allosaurus? You know, that's I told Mr. Hammond that I'm going to be in charge of code red responses. Really? Complete four code red sequences. Seriously? Four code reds? And a million coins for the carnivores, no less. So, okay. Hold, hold on a second, right? Okay, so Malcolm wants us to do this. So, for our next mission, I can already tell you where this is going, right? Uh, Kelly is going to want us to collect f like half a million coins from just members of the Triceratops family, right? Not not too hard, right? Yeah. But then John Hammond comes along and he's going to make some old man gibberish remarks and then wind up wanting like an entire fleet of Ferris wheels, co-sponsored of course by Dr. Henry Wu, no doubt. To add on to this, Dr. Grant will want us to move every dinosaur in the park, not once, not twice, not thrice, but quad, four times. And Malcolm will probably want us to complete like 32 code reds because he'll lose his notebook um, when Kelly like throws it in the ocean or something. And he'll just want us to do that to test his own version of chaos theory on us. Well, that's fan bloody tastic. So, now that we're done ranting, Let's go ahead and go under the sea. And we have a dollar. <laughs> Always exciting when you open up those little capsules, you know? You never know what you might find. You never know what. Most of the times it's nothing, but sometimes it's something. So... doesn't look like there's anything else to collect. Let's go ahead and see how much is our Haniosaurus that we were looking at earlier. 47,000. Alright. Well, we're only 100,000 off from that. So, maybe next time. 